So the first thing that I just want to discuss with you, or just want to remind you, the first thing whenever I'm doing any of these problems, especially writing the equation and finding the information, I need to visualize where everything is at. So it says the vertex is at 0, 0, and the focus is at 0, 2. So therefore, I know what the graph looks like here. Now, since from my previous previous maps uh, or previous um, ways that I showed a graph, we know the focus is always inside of my parabola. So my graph is going to look something like this. The next thing is I know that the distance p is the distance from the vertex to the focus. So now if I need to find the, if I need to find the point of my vertex to my directrix, I need to go down two units to find my directrix. Right? Because the distance between the vertex and the focus and the vertex and the directrix is equal. So anyways, if I know my vertex is at 0, 0, so I asked you to find the vertex, which was given. They gave you the focus. Now what you guys can see is I needed to go up 2 to go to my focus. So to find my directrix, I needed to go down 2. Please remember, though, this is a horizontal line. So your directrix is going to be y equals negative 2, whereas the other thing I asked you to find is the axis of symmetry is going to be on my, x, is going to be on my y axis, actually, Marina. So therefore, it would be x equals 0. And you guys can, again, follow. Just make sure that's all confirmed over there. X, um, eight, vertex is h comma k. So axis of symmetry would be x equals 0. And then obviously, the last thing I think I asked you guys to do is does the graph open up or down? You guys see the graph opens up. Now, to write, this in a, to write the equation of this line, Oliver, Basically, if you have, we know that it opens up. So therefore, we're going to have x squared. Anytime it opens up or down, x is going to be squared. So I have x minus h squared equals 4p times y minus k, whereas h and k represent the vertex. So really, that's just x minus 0 squared, which is just x squared. p is going to be 2. So that's going to be 8 times y. That's the equation. Because h and k are 0, right? 